we shall discuss now about the standard clauses that you will include in all the contracts starting with one the date of the contract the details of the parties if it is an individual it's about the legal identity or if it is a corporate company it's about the license or registration details including the address second the objective of the contract for what purpose you are drafting the contract third the term of the contract starting with commencement date to the expiry fourth the details of the purchase whether it is a goods or about if it is about the services fifth the price fees including any third party cost tax government fees if any so the total project value six the payment terms seven the obligation of the parties including their representation and warranties eight you talk about the delivery terms nine you talk about the different clauses with how we can terminate the contract the 10 the delay damages if there is any delay in the serv services or if there is delay in the delivery of the goods you talk about the delay damages you could also include about the breach of the contract if any party does a breach and what are the damages the other party is going to receive 12 it's about the replacement or the repairs or if it is a construction project you can talk about the defect liability period then 13 as a, these are all the standard clauses that you will include in the contract 13 you talk about the confidentiality terms between the parties 14 the indemnity 15 it's about the waiver clause 16 it's an entire agreement 17 you talk about the insurance if it is involved in the contract 18 it's an about the amendment any amendment it has to be with the mutual consent of the parties 19 severability if any clause is considered illegal it cannot affect the other clauses 20 you talk about the governing law of the contract and finally the jurisdiction so these are the standard clauses that you will apply in each and every contract that you will use